We start with the controversy in Richmond. Virginia Governor Ralph Northam is fighting for his political life this morning. It's after a photo surfaced from a college yearbook. It shows him as one of two people in either blackface or looking like a Klansman in a KKK uniform. We want to show you the image that raced to the top of national headlines. It's forced leaders from across the nation to call for his immediate resignation. The image appears on the governor's 1984 medical school yearbook page, and the governor admits that he is one of the two people in the photo, although he has not said which one. And new this morning, there's another picture that has surfaced. This is from VMI in Lexington from a 1981 yearbook. You can see below his name after the word goose, it lists a racist nickname, which we're not going to say on air. Governor Northam released this on camera apology last night, responding to the first photo, saying he is not going to resign. That photo and the racist and offensive attitudes it represents does not reflect that person I am today or the way that I have conducted myself as a soldier, a doctor, and a public servant. I am deeply sorry. I cannot change the decisions I made, nor can I undo the harm my behavior caused then and today. But I accept responsibility for my past actions, and I am ready to do the hard work of regaining your trust. I have spent the past year as your governor fighting for a Virginia that works better for all people. I am committed to continuing that fight through the remainder of my term and living up to the expectations you set for me when you elected me to serve. Thank you. Former Virginia Governor Terry McAuliffe and a fellow Democrat tweeted last night, quote, this has been a heartbreaking day. Ralph Northam is my friend and served well as my lieutenant governor and as governor. His actions on display in this photo were racist, unacceptable and inexcusable at any age and any time. The situation that he has put himself and the Commonwealth of Virginia in is untenable. It's time for Ralph to step down and for the Commonwealth to move forward. Senate Democrats are calling for fellow Democrat Governor Ralph Northam to resign as well. This is their statement. After seeing the yearbook pictures that surfaced of Governor Northam today, we were shocked, saddened, and offended. Virginia has a complicated racial history and past, and those pictures certainly reflect that. Blackface was used to ridicule African Americans and the Klan, and it was a source of terror and intimidation. The racism engendered by these images was real then and resurrected by these images today. We are beyond disappointed. The Ralph Northam we know is a pediatric neurologist, a dedicated public servant, and a committed husband and father. Nevertheless, it is with heavy hearts that we have respectfully asked him to step down. Should the governor resign or be ousted from office, now Lieutenant Governor Justin Fairfax would be next in line to become governor. So far, there's no word from him on the issue. NBC 12 in Richmond is reporting a grassroots political organization called RVA Dirt has planned a protest at the governor's mansion today. 10 News reporter Shane Dwyer is headed now to the Capitol. We will have much more on this growing scandal on air and on WSLS.com, where you can also find an interview from CNN with Jack Wilson, chair of the Virginia Republican Party.